Hi, my name is Marina Chapelsky. I'm a New York divorce and family attorney. We're located at 2415 Avenue U, Brooklyn, New York, 11229. Our phone number is 718-769-6352. And you can find us online at www.divorcelawyerny.org. I'm here today to discuss shortly what a stipulation of divorce settlement is and how it should be structured. Uh, oftentimes when spouses are finally ready to be uh, divorced and they're ready to settle all of their issues and ready to move on, the attorneys get together and help them put together an agreement or a contract which is called stipulation of settlement in their divorce. First of all, the issues that come up are children, of course, the most important thing. Uh, children uh, are addressed in the way that we focus on visitation, custody, and child support. Of course, parents are always interested in what they're going to do with them on school holidays. That's addressed on school recesses, on breaks, on weekends. Good attorneys who know what they're doing with family law should sit down and address that with you very specifically. And each family, of course, is different. Some families have religious holidays they want to address. Some families have uh, family occasions they want to address. So everyone should have questions written down and notes to give to their lawyer about the issues most important to them. Moving on, the next important issue to address in the stipulation settlement is the issue of property division or equitable distribution. People worry about their pensions. People want to talk about real estate they own, bank accounts, investment accounts, IRAs, brokerage accounts, and other types of things people grow together, accumulate during the marriage, and must be very specifically addressed. The law says that um, the property is addressed from the date of marriage to the date people file for the divorce. So that's the duration or the period of time that we take a snapshot or like a photo off and we focus on dividing. What is the difference between the time the people got married or the couple got married and the time they filed for divorce? Finally, people address in their divorces the issues of alimony or spousal support. That's very much today driven by the New York guidelines of maintenance and child support uh, guidelines and those are related. Every case is different. Very much, this, this issue very much depends on the income of both parties and we need to have income tax returns to back it up and every case is different. Other than that, miscellaneous issues that get addressed is that of course insurance issues, child, um, child health insurance, spouse's health insurance, life insurance policies, things like that that have to take care of everyone in case of divorce and after divorce and in case of illness or death. Basically, that's a short description of what a stipulation of settlement in a divorce is. If you have more questions, feel free to call us. Each case is different, is different and requires individual attention. We're uh, online at divorcelawyerny.org or you can call us at 718-769-6352. Good luck in all your family law and divorce endeavors.